Oh, you didn't know? One of the crazier instances of the Mandela Effect in the video game world is the story of Nintendo's hit character, the red and blue overall wearing plumber named Mario. According to a viral Reddit post about the subject, however, gamers around the world insist they remember his name being Harold. I swear to God, when I was seven, this Mario fucker was named Harold, and his brother, the green version of Harold, was named Luigi. I am 100% certain of this. Who else is from my dimension? So what's the deal? Are these confused gamers really from another dimension? Not quite. Mario's game designer Shiro Miyamoto explained to a reporter, I didn't have the money to pay for my braces, so I struck a deal with my orthodontist, Dr. Harold Martin, to name my video game character after him. And so, in 1983, Nintendo released Super Harold Brothers, whose name actually mistakenly implies that the brothers should be called Harold Harold and Luigi Harold. The game was released as a test exclusively in a Staten Island Toys R Us, but the reaction was very mixed. Fans loved the gameplay, but they felt that Harold's name was not Italian enough, and that his profession as an orthodontist should be more working class. Nintendo panicked and pulled all copies of the game so they could re-release it, changing nothing except for making Harold a plumber and his name Mario to pay off a different debt to Nintendo's landlord, Mario Segale. Despite the game only releasing for a mere three days, many copies of Super Harold Brothers spread around the globe, and today millions of fans worldwide seem to only remember the character as Harold. The rest video game history. My name is Chloe Dykstra for Hard Drive, and this was You Didn't Know. Join us next time as we dive into the Ultima Online chat logs that almost ended Bill Clinton's presidency.